the world is coming together to fight the menace of climate change. A few years ago, world leaders gathered in Glasgow to collectively decide on limiting global warming to desired levels. Indian Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi announced that the nation would reach a target of net zero by 2070. Today, 40% of global emissions and 60% of waste comes from building sector or related activities. Typical energy usage are residential sector, lighting 28%, heating and air conditioning 45%, refrigeration 13%, television 4%, other appliances 10%, commercial sector, lighting 23%, heating and air conditioning 60%, refrigeration 8%. Every G20 nation is working aggressively to forward the green building agenda both by transforming current structures and also by ensuring a green plan for buildings that are yet to be built. A green building consumes 51% less energy in non-air conditioned areas and 37% less energy in air conditioned areas. The rising challenge of building sector can be addressed by improving building material, water performance, energy performance, human health and comfort. This can also include building design features such as universal accessibility, passive design strategies, etc. In the next 10 years, the green buildings market across the world is expected to reach 10 billion square feet. Through careful design, material usage sourcing and recycling, a much-needed boost has been given to the sector. A direct result of the green building revolution in the country can be seen in India's first net-zero building that houses more than 600 officials, Pariyavaran Bhavan, in New Delhi. On this year of India's G20 presidency, let's join hands to accelerate green building initiatives to support Mission Live.